Hey guys, James from Reading here with Jackson Kike, and I'm really excited to walk you through how to install the brand new underseat utility bag. The underseat utility bag is gonna allow you to store up to four 3,700 tackle boxes underneath your seat and the kayak. And I'm gonna show you how to install that right now. The first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is remove the seat from the sliders. And then I just kind of flip it upside down. Then you wanna orient the bag so that the Jackson Kayak logo ends up right between the seat frame here. On each corner, you'll notice that there is a buckle and you just go around the seat frame here, buckle it into place and just work your way around the seat. After you have all four corners connected, again with the seat turned upside down, you wanna take the support strap and this is gonna give you support down the middle of the bag so that when you load it full of those tackle boxes, it doesn't sag. So I like to go around the frame from the bottom part of the frame in the back first. So that the buckle is easy to access and tighten down. On this seam right here, right in the dead center, there's gonna be a gap that you can pass this strap through. And then fold that out of the way. Once you have that, you go over top of this front bar and back through that gap. And then just attach it to the buckle. And pull it tight. That's again going to support the weight of those tackle boxes once you have it installed. At this point, you can replace the seat back into the sliders. And that's it. Your bag is installed. Once you have it installed, you'll notice that the closures on the outside of the frame, you've got a zipper pocket and you can have four 3700s, two on each side. The last thing is the closure that's going to hold that front flap closed so you want to tuck those buckles so they go around the frame on either side of the seat cover. What I like to do once I have it installed is add my boxes in there so I can kind of test it for the weight and then adjust these straps on each corner to tighten them up as I need them and that'll really kind of dial in that fit to make sure that it's right where I want it to be. As you can see, you got both of them in there. Now, inside, you will notice that you have these little pull tabs. Pull those out before you put your boxes in. You'll see that they push back into the bag. And those will allow you, when you're sitting in the seat, you can simply grab those pull tabs, and pull them forward, and it'll slide the boxes out so it makes it easier for you to access those boxes. Again, to close it, Pull it up with the buckles around the seat frame on either side. And then you can also tighten those up just to keep everything nice and clean. In addition to being able to store four 3,700 boxes inside and having the zipper pockets, you also have two pockets, one on each side of the bag to store small miscellaneous items. The under seat utility bag works great when the seat is in the high position on all of our kayaks. And it also works on the bite, which only has one position. If you wanna use it in a low position, you can do so with just two boxes in the bag. If you wanna use all four boxes in the bag in the low position, I'll show you a little hack that you can do to your seat sliders so that you can do it in the low or high position and move it throughout the day with no problem. So again, remove the seat. And now remove the seat sliders. Get this rod out of the way. You do that by taking the two T-knobs out. Slide the frame out. Make sure you don't lose your washers. And on the bottom side of the seat sliders, you'll see that you have access to this screw on each side that holds this bar in place. And because you have the T-knobs and the bolts in the track, it's gonna keep this from spreading apart or separating with that seat in there. And this is kind of a redundancy just to add a little more strength, but the seat's gonna to be totally fine if you remove this bar. And I would only do this if you're gonna be using this under seat bag 
in the low position. It works great in the high and you can still get two boxes in the low, but by removing this bar with a Phillips head screwdriver and just taking those two screws out, one on each side, you'll be able to utilize the low position. So I'm gonna do that now. Once you have the bar out, you can set that aside and then reinstall the seat sliders. You place your washer, reinstall your T-knobs, and replace the seat. Now the bag can be used in the low position with no problem with all four 3,700 boxes inside of it. And there you have it, the Jackson Kayak Underseat Utility Bag. For more information, including where to find a dealer, be sure to check out jacksonkayak.com.